Hello everyone, you are welcome to another video. In this video, I will be showing you how to import images into Jupyter Notebook. So let's say you are working on a particular data science project having to do with maybe image classification or you are working on a NumPy array. Uh, you know that it is very important to import the images you want to use for the project so i'll just show you the four uh, four ways you can use to import uh, images into jupyter notebook i'll open a new python 3 okay so here we have it now, um, one thing you have to know is that in the, in the when when you are importing image into the Jupyter notebook, the um, the directory of the image, that is the folder of the image, should be the same as that of the Jupyter notebook. The the, the 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 image directory must be the same directory as this particular Jupyter notebook environment you are working on. So that means you cannot pick an image from another drive and import it into the Jupyter Notebook in another drive. So that is what it is. Now, when you when when we come here now, this is the directory we are working on. So you can see that the image you want to um, import is in this folder. So when I click on it, the image is password image.jpg. So the image folder is a sub directory of the uh, Jupyter notebook environment that i am currently working on so the first way first method Now the first method, I'll simply convert this to a markdown first. And then I'll write this line of code, image source equals Okay, so um, I'll put in the, uh, the um, file part to the image which is image forward slash password image dot jpg okay so this is the uh, define name okay password image dot jpg now when we run this shift plus enter okay so that is the first method the second method okay we are now uh, in this particular one we are going to use um, a, a normal code cell so so calling the function from i python import display so we say display dot image Okay, then we pass in the path. Okay, so this is the second method. So you can see that so IPython is a is a is a function okay that enables us to actually display um, uh, images. 
mão de todo o meu todo. So now um, this will be Okay, so um, so in this particular case, we have this this password is an alternative uh, text. You know, uh, should in case this image does not display for maybe reasons best known to the system, um, the password will be shown as the alternative text. You know, um, in place of this particular image. So with this, I'm, I'm going to convert the cell to a markdown cell. So this particular um, code, line of code, works with a markdown cell. Now I run this. Okay, you can see it has changed to the image. So that means so far, um, two methods work with a markdown cell. The first method and uh, the third method. Now the fourth method. So in this particular method, it involves me um, copying the uh, the image from the folder into the uh, Jupyter notebook environment. So that means I also I'm also going to change this to a Markdown. That works with a Markdown, and it's quite the easiest. So I'm going to um, divide. I'm going to actually split the. Um, this uh, um, image or well, I'm going to split this environment into two so windows plus arrow and then so this is the um, file or this is the folder that is having the image so what I'll do in this fourth method is I'll simply copy drag uh, the image and I'll drop it here So when I drag, when I when I drop it, uh, what will I do? I will now uh, run it. So as I've run, you can see that it has changed to uh, the image. So these are the four ways you can use to import image into the Jupyter Notebook environment. I hope you have uh, enjoyed this video. Please, I would encourage you to uh, like um share it and subscribe subscribe so that you can always get amazing um, content on my channel i hope you have learned something new today thank you very much and see you next time bye